Hello everyone, it's Peter here, Pet Fistner. How are you doing guys? Hello. So, uh, this will be a quick episode about this Xbox. This Xbox had a shorted one of the two main main boards and this was the this was the South Bridge main board and when I checked with voltage injection I couldn't see heat anywhere dissipation but I had only one volt and only like one two amps so it was nothing um, and that's that's not really a lot yes then we've we removed some components on because we've checked coils and one of the coils was shorted the rest wasn't so we removed that short by uh, by removing one of the capacitors I'll show you the pictures so these were two capacitors and that the top one uh, hold on a sec the top one was fine that's 20 microfarads and that's 20 microfarads probably as well so we didn't have i had 10 microfarads 0603 size because that's 0603 size so we i asked my uh, technician here to put two tens because that's the same line and it was fine yes it was okay so that's this this part ql uh, minus or equal 8f uh, something like 4 5j or n n 5j um, and we remove these capacitors here those those capacitors here we've placed them back again uh, he did my technician did and uh, well the, the short was gone as soon as the second capacitor here because that's on the second side of the board yes so as soon as this capacitors will capacitor was removed then uh, that's that's when we found that there's no more short um, but they had to increase believe or not over one volt it was 1.5 volt to find um, that this cap, cap was causing that issue so another case of having a component which is less of a grain of a rice which caused a short to the xbox and this would be deemed no fixed but because of that we can now see it was no light completely you couldn't even press it on and let's switch to the a capturing card you see you've got it you've got it. I don't want to show because there's you know like customers account and so on um, I don't know if there's any disk inside oh it was so customer left uh, GTA 5 Xbox one um, that that's okay uh, I've got I've got even this disk here so you see it's it's easy when you know how but my technician is leveling up and he's learning now about short circuits on the main board and now he was you know he've learned on one all in one pc now is the second time when he's seen <clears throat> in purpose i don't use thermal camera i just use old-fashioned techniques like find which board because you've got two main boards which board is shorted how to do it then when you've got the board which is shorted how to voltage inject safely and then once it's voltage injected <clears throat> if you can't find a short see where it's going to check the other side uh, check um, check that second side as well and then when you see that maybe on the second side is still nothing increase slightly don't put 12 volts you know or something just increase slightly that you will have not a lot of voltage volts coming in uh, because you don't know where it's short going yes if it's going to apu you can burn it for instance yes so we don't want it so 1.5 volt is still okay and then it was slowly but heating up that capacitor that you could distinguish the difference yes so patience as well tranquility um and uh, and this way you know he he's learned it yes so i would say that more and more of those jobs and he will be starting to pre uh, becoming <laughs> excuse me starting to become a a professional with those shorts yes at the moment he, i'm still looking at his hands he can do other repairs comfortably he's a really good help here and um, but when it comes to shorts i need to be on top of it still so yes probably a few more jobs and he will be fine but you see good example that xbox is live just by removing one single component and 
replacing it with with another component yes so that's it uh, that's all I wanted to show you in this video so thank you guys for watching just the preview x70 came from Qbot uh, for my wife so we will open it there will be video about it and I'll show you the uh, x70 uh, where is my phone here so now Qbot King Kong 9 yes big bulky racked phone and that one should be regular phone um, so I'm looking forward to do that and then yes we will see if it is will be a good one we in, when we start a launch membership in the next year we will be um, getting spare parts for them and we will be getting them in stock for sure for our members so thank you guys for watching and see you in the next video bye bye